As you can see in these video clips, my monitor is flickering quite a lot, and that is without any HDMI, DisplayPort cables connected to a PC or a laptop, and this is demonstrated pretty well when you open up the menu of the actual monitor. So that means if the monitor's menu is actually flickering as well, that means it's on the main board side rather than your laptop or your desktop, you know, your Windows system, Mac OS, whatever, it must be on the monitor side. Even if we have a laptop or a PC connected for a HDMI or DisplayPort, you can see it's still flickering. And I did find a fix for this actually. That involves disassembling the monitor, removing the back cover, getting to the main board, removing the NVIDIA chip and baking it in the oven. Then of course, we're gonna put it all back together and give it a test run before we actually put the back lid back on. Okay, so my panel keeps flickering on and off. Every time I turn it on, it's like it needs to warm up first. Around five minutes in, it will stop flickering. So I definitely know that the problem is not GPU. So obviously, as you can see, this is the bottom. Let's see if anything is feels more accessible this side. Huh, that does lift. Like this area is lifted okay yeah. oh there we go now we have some action see that that unclipped it I think I can see, yeah, a little area that you can push. So I'm gonna try to keep it doing this. Just make sure that the camera can see what I'm doing. Otherwise, that kind of makes the video pointless. There we go. That was that felt like something else. Or maybe the starting point was here because there was a little protrude, there's a little hole here. See? I'm not sure if you can, guys can see this alright. Ah, there. There's a little hole here in this corner. And now there is a gap there, so we're getting somewhere, I think. So I thought I'm gonna try to continue doing small. It's at a time. Now it does feel like it's shifting. Yeah, in a good way. It does feel like it's detaching, which is good. And but yep, yeah, see, same same hole on this side as well. Yeah. So let's do this side. There, that was good. Ah, that's not very good there. Mm, I'm gonna try going from the middle again because I'm not, I'm not feeling much movement here besides the start where I started. I'm kind of like tiptoeing so that uh, you guys can see this. Oh, there we go. That's that's good. That's good. Keep that blade away from the screen. The screen is good. I think it's the main board that main board that's gone dodgy. Oh, that. Be careful. That that's good. That's good. I feel that they're clicking. <sighs> I 
Yeah, I've been staying away from fixing this for like a long time because it's been p pissing me off so much. <laughs> like, I just didn't want to let a thousand quid go to waste. But, I mean, I'm not using this. There we go. Is that, I think that's the whole side. So basically the idea was to get this fixed and then sell it on because I'm not using this. Uh, I need a higher resolution rather than a higher refresh rate. Okay, so now we start moving it away. But what about the other sides, other corners? There we go. Can you guys still see? No, you can't see this, so zoom out. So I'm not squeezing this, otherwise that would kind of uh, defeat the purpose of what I'm doing. There we go, good. Okay, that feels good, so now I'm gonna try to do the bottom side. Oh, there we go, that's good. Felt that declip. Okay, this complete side done. Then the other side. So yeah, um, one thing that you do want to do, make sure all the VESA screws, all those screws are unscrewed. And let's continue to this side. So this is unscrewed. So let's put a black plastic there. And start prying. And then move that plastic bit down, I think. Keep it elevated. And what I'm not going to do is I'm not going to insert the blade and twist it, otherwise that will mark the plastic. Because this exacto blade, of course, is very thin. Excuse me. good I think as long as I'm not cracking anything Nearly there. There we go. There we go. So yeah, the top. Just want to make sure there's nothing touching. So yeah, the top. We didn't even touch the top. Nice. For the clips on the bottom side, 
the clips aren't here on the bottom side where the monitor is this side is the clip holes and the clips are on the back on the inside of this piece so let me just show you yes one hole there There, there. I'm not sure how how these are. There, 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 there. And let me show you. So, flip this round. So this is the bottom of the monitor. There we go. Clip, 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 clip. Oh, and here. And for this side, clip, clip, clip. I think I broke one clip. Is that broken? I'm not sure. Yeah. So let's do let's do top side first. This is the top side. And bottom side. Okay, actually, no, I'm going to do sides first. Sides. There. Nothing here. Same on this side. And then let's do the bottom. 